I would love to see this. I would rather see nothing than be haunted by things I don't wear. And I moved into this house and I've got a closet bigger than a closet I ever thought I'd have. Yet somehow within weeks, I have completely filled it up. I don't need all that. My messy closet is making me feel mentally messy. It's become a stress center for me. So I have recruited an expert to help me cleanse that closet. My name is Jessie Freshall. I'm with Fresh Style. I'm a personal stylist and closet organizer. Hi, hi. Are you ready to do this? I'm ready, I'm ready. Stephanie has amassed quite a bit of clothing over the years. I think she's let the closet kind of get away from her because she's focused on her children and her career. I'm gonna start by cleaning out the closet. And then once I have everything kind of assessed in the closet, I'm gonna to put together a system that's gonna work for her. How would we start? Like I look at this and I'm like, I can't believe I fill it with these shoes and now the shoes don't even fit. Well, we're gonna go through each shoe. We're gonna literally take them all out and we're gonna go through and we're gonna figure out what shoes you're wearing, which shoes don't feel good. My number one tip for decluttering a closet is to take it all out and go through it piece by piece. When you actually touch something, you evoke an emotion, you think, oh my gosh, I tried these shoes on, they killed my foot. There are a lot of things that if I paid $20 for these shoes or $50 for these shoes and I've never worn them and I've had them in my closet for five years, the chances are you're never gonna wear them, so I would remove them. Except today, I'm gonna wear them today. And then you okay. can't make me throw them out. Where are we wearing this? A hold down? A hold down, maybe. <laughs> A hold down? No, we're gonna get rid of it. Yeah, I think, you know, everything, you remember when you bought it. I think time and time again, what I see often is clients that hold on to things because they evoke a memory. And by throwing something out, they feel that they're throwing the memory out. Those memories aren't going anywhere. They're gonna still be with you just because the dress isn't here. The goal of organizing your closet is more than just having a place for your clothes to live. It's a peace of mind. Having an organized closet allows you to get dressed faster in the morning. It allows you to be more productive. When you feel confident in what you're doing and what you're wearing, you also are more successful in your day. For the past several days, I have taken Stephanie's closet and transformed it into a closet that makes sense and works for her. One of the things I've done for Stephanie is I've organized her closet light to dark, and I've done that throughout her closet in the different categories. Here we have several different labels organized by different types of objects. Drawers. These are so important to keep organized, and they're so easy to do. So. We have labels, and then we have the way that they're folded. So they're folded vertically, so you can see everything when you look at the drawer. So this looks complicated, but it is not. You simply are just folding a few more times. So the pants are folded. You fold once, you fold twice, stick it in the drawer, and you're done. All right, Jesse, this is our big reveal. <sighs> I feel like I don't know whose house this is. I don't even know how you did this. Looking at this makes me feel better inside, not just because, yes, it's clean and it was a mess before, but I feel like I have a system. This closet is complete and it is a beauty. We have accomplished um, keeping it in a system that is organized and is attainable really to any closet size. Once you put in the initial effort of organizing and that frees up mental clutter. I can tell you, this closet makes me feel good. I hope you do this in your home. Not just for your clothes, do it for your mind. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.